What are your no-nos for a nonprofit? What shouldn't they do when they're developing a major donor pipeline? Uh, be bashful. You should not be bashful. <laughs> what do you do if you're bashful? Uh, get over it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> It, it's it's what Margie says. It's, if that's the hardest thing you do, uh, do it in the beginning of the day, right? Yeah. And, and and get it past you. So what that means basically is get out. You know, try and get outside your comfort zone. If you need to be coached, have an executive coach to help you get over yourself. Yeah. And to do yeah. the job. And to. And you're not asking. You. And you're not asking for yourself, you're asking for something much larger than yourself. Well, oh, that, that goes, well, I'm glad you brought it up, but that definitely, it, it comes to, if you're having trouble with those kinds of basic things, then you need to examine your personal mission and how yeah. well it aligns with your organizational mission. And you may find that there is misalignment. And if you're not aligned with what you do for a full-time job, day in and day out, with what your organization stands for, well, then you should be looking for another job where, where there is alignment because yeah. you will always have obstacles in front of you when there's not alignment. 